One woman wants to share her message of hope after battling stage four lung cancer. Kevin Sydney Thorson brings us to Rapid City, where Carol Engel and Monument Health officials share their story. What started off as a preventative care visit at Monument Health two years ago turned into a biopsy and CT scan. It came back, stage four lung cancer had metastasized to my brain, the back of my knee, my liver, under my arm, everywhere. Doctors said she had just six months to live. It's shocking and you feel so alone and you don't know where to turn. Until Monument Health came into the picture. Here at the cancer care facilities, there are treatments like immunotherapy and infusion services. Engel started with immunotherapy, then switched to chemotherapy when her progress slowed. Well, I could only do two rounds of that chemo because it made me so sick. So doctors switched Engel back to immunotherapy. As of December, I'm in remission. All the tumors are gone. Don Yutzman, a family nurse practitioner, was the one who recommended that Carol get screened for lung cancer because of her history of smoking. Yutzman says Carol's success shows just how far treatments have come. If this would have happened even five years ago, it would be an unfortunate discussion of get your affairs in order. We will do everything we can to keep you comfortable. But now we can say we do have some new drugs that tell your immune system to see the cancer and fight it. Engel has a message for anyone battling cancer. Take a deep breath, look around, slow down, and just think positive. It works. In Rapid City, Sydney Thorson, Kelloland News. Uh, Carol lives a busy life and works summers at Bear Country. She has two grandchildren and continues to take care of her 90-year-old mother. Coming up in less than an hour, CBS, along with other major television networks, will be airing the annual Stand Up to Cancer Telethon to raise money for more cancer research. That begins at 7 p.m. Central Time.